suck heads, eat tail, sing the blues, and know where they got them shoes. Crack open a cold one and get ready for some football. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The insane Colts go up against the New Orleans Zombies. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, that's good. But I flunked my model. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. And it just rips a good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Kaboom! And the quarterback on the and he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. And he catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. Footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First and ten. Man, this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's.
yards, first and ten. He zings it in there for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Watch out, the ball carriers brought a chase onto the field. Die. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for... Oh, what a brutal hit! Second down and more than the QB would like. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. It's about a three yard pickup. Second down and seven. One, two, three. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self -dying. But he seems to have worked through it. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for. You know what? Never mind. First and ten. Well, that play didn't work. He'll have to rethink that. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. 
Second down and ten. First and ten. He refuses to go, and then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called shit. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge bender right now. Devastating hit knocks the ball loose. Mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. Right. 
wrestling. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and two. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Bricks, it's the two-minute warning. You know what that means? Whiskey? And it's first and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Your home teammate catches the explosive ball. That's why you always have to listen in the huddle, kids. Oh, I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down and ten. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And it's first and ten. First down. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just cock blocked the clock. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Hey, timeouts are kind of like condoms, you know, Grim? You got to use them smart if you want to score. Let's see if they did. Second down and long. That's a six-yard gain on that catch. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. First and ten. Nice run for five yards. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. So you can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. Second down and five. He runs it for three. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. 
Uh, that's okay, Grin. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. Oh, Mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone! Once he finds his head, he'll be okay! And that'll be their final timeout. And it's first and ten. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. Thank you. I'm leaving them. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer? Third quarter, we are all tied up and set to kick off the second half. Uh, speaking of all tied up, Grim, how many of them elephant lags in the belt did I take? Uh, I feel like I'm sitting on Mount Vesuvio right now. Oh, one false move, and I'm gonna blow! Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. He had it for a second there. Second down and ten. And that's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. And that'll bring up third and one. First and ten. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. <laughs> Second down and a lot. Third down and forever. Hey, man, I was here on the panel now. You know what happened? Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. You can't keep a good mute. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. He took a beast. Injection. Now watch fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. Man, guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. And it's 
First and ten. They've called a zap attack. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. He's at the 40. The 30. He's at the 20. The 10. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. Um, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. is important and it's first and ten <laughs> maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too second down and ten <laughs> the ball into the defense picking up seven third down and three and then a first down from a great catch was it a catch though let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out and it's first and ten Second down and five. He had it for a second there.
The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Well, the way the quarterback said they'd blow up the defense today. <laughs> hey, he know, was right. Lady. No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and ten. We're tied up at the end of the third quarter. You can smell the excitement on the fans. I mean, literally, it is ripe in here. Man. Junior, was that you? Hey, blow me. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. I know. I hate those zebra men. down and never and they've had enough the offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref <laughs> third down and the offense needs a miracle Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. First down and five. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkey skin wrapped on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. Goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Your mother ever tell you don't run with a chainsaw? <laughs> First down and nine. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball. Oh, it's a punishing hit. Second down and more than the QB would like. Sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with 
soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Third down and forever. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Scrambled, he'll be thinking about bad hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. Up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a. Uh, <laughs> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Third and two. <laughs> and the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is a palm grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, he just got pulverized by a mutant trap. And it's first and ten. Bring up second and one. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First and ten. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down and seven. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. That's 
that's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, MFL isn't episodic. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing. Call the one speed dirty trick. He's so fast, he watches 60 minutes and 60 seconds. Second down. He stumped the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. It's a glitterception! What's that, Grim? Oh, with the brain scrambler! <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big ball. The defense has to make something happen here with one timeout left. Second down and a lot. And like a monkey trying to... Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And that's the last time out. The D has to either break the clock or the offense if they want to win. Hey, as long as something gets broke, right? It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm. That's bleak, Bricks. It's good. The zombies showing no life at home go down in defeat. I used to date a zombie, Grim. She wanted to get into broadcasting, and asked if she could pick my brain. What was I talking about? They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chunks choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that was beautiful. No, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right every other.